Scotty part 18. All right, right back at where we started, or just left off. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where we left off, not where we started. Okay, so the puzzle. Oh, she's here. She's going to tell us about the puzzle. Where are you? None of the others ever made it this far. <laughs> you know what this is? It's a lock, a tonal lock. Simple and very, very deadly. See the resonators up there. Strike them in the right order, and a door should open. Get it wrong, and well, you've seen what happened when I tried it. I don't think you got this far. Oh, right. Yeah, I thought I was prepared for anything. <laughs> How can you prepare for a damned earthquake? And that was just one trap. Look around. Who knows what else this thing is capable of? Hmm. Well, you can pick up where I left off. My notes should still be in my journal, if you can read it. Beyond that, well, maybe one of our predecessors still has a clue. Okay. So, you can loot all this stuff. Uh, we don't need that. As you can tell, uh, and if you look down along the ground, you can see where there's some arrows where people have failed in the past. <laughs> they come in here and they, the whole Indiana Jones situation. See, here's some arrows. Arrow got this dude here. Uh, this adventurer has a scrap of paper and he's got some information as well. So, also, we don't want to waste our bolts on these tonal locks. Cannot remember exactly what the order is, so we're going to. And you see, it automatically auto saves here, um, unless you maybe have auto save off. So, um, Katria's journal. If you flip the pages, so it's one two. Um, I think it's one two on the bottom, and then three in the upper left, four on the upper right, and then five in the middle. If I remember correctly. And what was there? It was a scrap of paper. Yeah. So one, two, three, four, five. Five being the last one in the center. So we've got our bowl. So it's going to be one, two, three, four, five. So you just have to hit in the area. You don't actually have to hit it. You can use it with a fireball or something like that, too. Keep going. Oh, whoops, come on. Four. Almost. A little bit short. <laughs> Five. And then either door doesn't make any difference. And there's an ethereal shard. Take what's in the goodies here. Madness ore. I don't know what that's for yet. I haven't done that quest so, yet. It is real. Yeah. What is this? Let me see it. Hmm. You're not gonna take it, are you? Look, <laughs> on the edge here. This has been cut, precisely cut. If you had another piece about the same size, it would it would snap right in. I saw a drawing of this once. This shard, it's its part of a key. A key made of pure ethereum. The key to the forge. We have to find the other pieces, of course. There should be, hmm, three more. One for each of the four cities that worked on the forge. I had a map in my journal. That's where we should start. Really? Well, now that makes things easier. <laughs> we still have to find the forge itself. I had a lead on that, too. Ah, oh, there's so much to do. I'm going to head out and start tracking things down. We'll meet again. I'm sure of it. I'm sure we will. For the first time in a long while, I think I... We may actually be able to do this. And, and I owe it all 
to you. Thank you. Yeah. Usually one of my favorite NPCs in the game. She's just so pleasant. You know, and it's, although she was trying to track something down and you could argue she's nothing but a thief, she's, you know, not exactly like a you know, bad thief or anything like that. We might as well take this because we've got the carry weight. Uh, that's a gear. We don't need the gear. Oh, there's a couple of chests on the wall here. Okay, now, back out, and we'll probably go the long ways around. The last part that we need to pick up is that the same ruin that you killed Delane, or Elaine DeFont, or whatever his name is, as part of the, um, was it Morning Never Comes quest from the Dark Brotherhood? I can't remember. I don't ever do the Dark Brotherhood anymore because I don't like the quest line. Uh, it's boring. I will do it for for some characters because I think that one of the best ways to disrupt the Empire is to kill the Emperor. I mean, duh. So we're looping back around. And I can't remember which direction exactly. When we get closer, I'll know, I think. If you backtrack all the way back around... I think there's eventually, you'll have to go, there's a fork or something. So here's a little tunnel. We better get, get down and get ready. Oh, no way. Nope, I already came this way. Oh, well, this is the other way. Because I can hear one of those creepy crawlies. It's on the other side here. Oh my goodness, there's two of them. Move. Oh boy. No, no, no. No, no, you can't see me. You can't see me. Oh. Whew, that was close. Those guys will mess your day up. They're worse than frostbite spiders. We don't need all of these. I'm not gonna pick. I'm not gonna sit here and pick all these chorus eggs because you don't use a bunch of invisibility anyway. You don't need to. And I want your sneak skill gets high enough. You don't need to use invisibility potions, even with ordinator perks. You know, and I think we can see that. The crossbow doesn't actually blow your sneak status, so we're doing good here. Oh, maybe this is how we had to come. I can't remember. Right, we're going to save it right here, just in case I fall to my death accidentally. Oh, no. Yeah. Uh, okay, ready? Here we go. Whoop. Ah! Ooh. thought there was another way, but I guess I'm... Oh, boy. Wrong. I can't remember. I couldn't remember. Oh my goodness. Oh jeez, that's scary. Oh, you know what I'm thinking of? I'm thinking of Tovald's Cave. Tovald's Cave, you, you, there's a, like two different ways or something. I think if we follow this water around, we can get up. Well, uh, we can get up against that rock. Can we get off of it? Are we stuck? We're stuck. We're clipping through the rock. Okay. Steel bolt? Okay. <laughs> I don't know where the steel bolt came from, but okay. Riding the rapids here. Come on, get off of there. Oh, here's a, here's a, ah, come on, God. Ah, oh, there we go. Don't need the poison. I think this is the way up. Nope, it's the way to a chest, though. Circle it. I'm not gonna click around those glowing mushrooms. They're so, they're so fickle. I'm not gonna mess around with them. Let's see here. How do we get up? Where's the up ramp? Here it is. Over here somewhere. Here it is. Against the against the flow of water too, of course. Easy, easy. And we're out safely.
<laughs> Just in case. Well, hi. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here. Thought I saw something else, but maybe not. Let's see where the Forge Master fingers are. Lost to the ages. Where's the quest at? What happened to it? Lost to the ages. Break of dawn. What in the world? What happened to the quest? I don't I no longer have the Forge Master's Fingers quest. That's lost to the ages. Book of Love and My Time of Need. Angler Acquaintances. Uh yeah. So that's gone. Hmm. I wonder how much complication that's going to cause. Periite Shrine, that's the one over there by Bethardums. Yep. Yep. Wow. Uh, that's not good. We had a map marker at one point, but I don't remember. Let's go back and see if we can get it again real quick. I don't know what's going to happen. Excuse me. Can anybody help me here? Excuse me. <laughs> Hi. Uh, I have a question. This is a... We don't know you. And we don't want you here. Malakath blesses us with this land. It's not for your kind. Um, okay. That's kind of jacked up. Because the quest has disappeared. I've never had that happen before. But I never do the... Forge Master Fingers quest. Uh, okay, well. That thing got all jacked up. So the next part of it is going to be... Let's see. It's up here just past Othering Hills Cave. I think that it's right up here is another Dwemer Ruin. That's where we're heading next for the last piece of the shard of the Ethereal Key. Alright, I want to say thanks for watching, and we'll pick it up next over by Windhelm as we head up to get the last piece. And uh, again, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you on the next video.